Hi, my name's Genevieve. I work at AM Solar and today we're actually at our outpost location, we like to call it. This is where our shipping department is located. Because of all our awesome customers, we got to expand last year. So we're really excited to have this new space so we can send as many orders out as we can get and as quickly as possible. All right, so today we're gonna talk about what do you do when you get your DIY kit. There are hundreds of pieces often depending on what you ordered. So we'd like to provide a pick list or a packing list in your box for you to go through your items individually. You should have a retail receipt that identifies the kit and then the pick list aside from it so you can see all the items broken out. You'll also get some important information, a little flyer about returns if you did need to return any items as well as a return material request form. So you have all those pieces in your box as well as all the items for you to go through. Once you get your box, I recommend laying everything out and going through your pick list and identifying each individual item. If you have a hard time figuring out which matches to which in the part number versus the actual part you're looking at, you can either use the website for reference, we have lots of photos on there, or if you still can't find it, take a photo of what you have and you're not able to match and email info at amsolar.com. We'll be able to help you match it up. And if for some reason there is an item missing, we'll be able to send that item back out for you. So you're unpacking your kit. You will see the different kits broken out into different baggies. For this example, you have the 94VS BB100. It has your lugs and heat shrink, positive and negative corresponding. You'll have your cable all in one length. So in this example, we have a base kit and a couple of expansions. The full cable length will be in just one spool. So you'll have the cable labeled for your gauge as well as the total length. Don't freak out if you don't see your batteries. The batteries are drop chipped. They won't be in these boxes. So if you get one box and it looks real small, don't worry, your battery's not in there. You'll get a second tracking email for those batteries. While you're waiting for your batteries to show up, the next best step after you've gone through all the items on your pick list is to check for your diagrams so you can start planning out your installation. You can search for your diagrams by finding your corresponding kit number and using the search bar on the website. If you know where the kit is on the website, they're also listed there. And we have a DIYers page where it has instructional videos on how to use tools, how to hook up different parts of the system, as well as programming for any of your components, BMB 712, your MPPT charge controllers, all the fun stuff like that. So you've gone through your whole kit, you've got your diagrams, and you're still confused, we do have tech support for you. So go to amsolar.com, there's a button on there that says request support, fill that out, we're happy to help you out. If there's anything else you need in the process, feel free to call our office. We're there to answer your questions, or at least get you started in the right direction. Have fun. Oh no, I forgot my mask. Elise, are you wearing your mask?